Hey guys, Eric Kyle here, publisher of Great Lakes Scuttlebutt Magazine. I'm at the Detroit Boat Show with Steve Popke. He's with Great Lakes Marine Innovations. We've got some incredible products here I thought you might want to know a little bit more about, so I'm going to turn you over to Steve. Steve, how are you doing today? Good, how are you doing, Eric? I'm doing fantastic. I'm enjoying the show up here in Detroit. How about you? Oh yeah, lovely. Good turnout so far on the first day. Good. Well, let's keep it. Let's let's hope it keeps on going. Hey, so um, Great Lakes Marine Innovations, you guys have got a, all kinds of really cool stuff. Can you tell our readers a little bit about what it is you have to offer? Yeah, pretty much. We basically integrate marine innovations to the common day consumer. We offer a wide line of LED lighting to flooring, interior and X, to dinghy sails, inflatable boats. And we also offer our new line of bow loungers that pretty much just take the ease of relaxation on the bow of your boat to a whole new level. Outstanding. Now tell me a little bit about these bow loungers. Is this something that I just throw up on my boat or is this something that attaches to the boat or how does this work? Well, you pretty much nailed it on the head is how does it work and it's however the customer wants it to work. You can either attach it to the boat with a tongue and groove channel. You can snap it on like regular canvas or you can just have it sit on there and take it off when you want. It's pretty much the customer's preference. We've seen them all from getting tied down with rope to snaps to channels to just let it flow and free and however you want. Now there's different colors and configurations. Do you figure out with the customer what they want in their boat or is this coming like standard sizes and shapes and colors? Well standard size is around 72 inches by 27 inches which is this uh, red and white one right here. Okay. But uh, it's usually based on whatever the boat has. For example, this bow lounger is fitted for a 46 Sea Ray. Uh, I believe it's around 96 inches wide. So it's mainly a custom thing, but a standard size that fits on almost any boat would be 72 long by 27 wide and it's uh the color is just based on whatever the customer wants okay if i wanted to find out more information about bow lounger where do i go what do i do you just go to glmarineinnovations.com click on contact us and write us a brief email stating what boat you have what colors you like and we'll be happy to get in touch with you outstanding now you also offer a product called new tea this seems to be a pretty popular new kind of product and service for the Great Lakes region. Tell us a little bit about Nutik. Nutik is pretty much a European company that started because they outlawed the use of real teak on boats in Europe for environmental reasons. So they came up with a synthetic deck which eliminates maintenance, so no staining, varnishing, sanding to help the environment and to help you know the customer enjoy his boat instead of working on it. What it is is a synthetic deck made out of PVC material, it's stain resistant, UV resistant, it has a 20 year warranty and instead of working on your boat you're just going to be enjoying it and that's what uh, it's all about here in the Great Lakes Boat. <laughs> Absolutely. Community. Now I see you got multiple different products out here this so it comes in different interior, colors. This is an interior vinyl. Okay. And what it is, it's pretty much the same type of concept. Zero maintenance, carpet stains, gets dirty, this is stain resistant. You lay it down and you forget about it. So spill all the wine and have all the kids and dogs that you want. Zero maintenance. <laughs> what about the exterior stuff? Is that what this is down here? Yeah, this is uh, a showman. Um, the beauty of this is, I mean, it's everybody, this is winter here and everyone's walking on here with everything other than their boat shoes on. It holds up great, it cleans off real easy. Uh, it's a standard color, however, you can get uh, white, white seams or black seams. Okay. Again, it's uh, stain resistant and it's UV resistant, which makes it the exterior version. And if I wanted to find out more information about you guys offering Nutique, where would I go? What would I do? You just go back to glmarineinnovations.com. Uh, we have a full page of interior and exterior. If you're looking for something more specific, again, just look us up on the contact section and write us a brief email or whatever that your inquiry is about. Outstanding. Well, let's go around the corner here and tell me a little bit more about the LED lights. Yeah, the LED lights is a new wave of the future. It's pretty much 
best way will you to have those drunken nights where you forget to turn off the lights to your boat and you won't worry about draining your battery? If I have use about 80% less than your condescent or halogen bulbs. 80% less electricity draw? That's 80, yeah, that's exactly right. 80% less. So for one condescent bulb, you can run almost four LED bulbs would be the equivalent. Uh, they draw almost next to nothing uh, energy. And for example, this is this is my favorite piece right here. What this is, this is a LED faucet light. You attach it to your faucet, and it turns water color based on the temperature. Now, the reason I think this is so cool, besides the concept of it, this doesn't use any batteries. Or it has no power. The way it gets it is when water runs through it. Uh, as a hydraulic system to generate power. So that yeah. shows you as a testimony that the LEDs don't require any energy. And that's why supposedly uh, we're supposed to turn to them as a, for the LEDs in the country in the next few years. Everyone else does it, America's trying to get on board. Yeah, we're coming close. It looks like interior and exterior lighting here, right? Yeah, we offer everything from the salon to the outside deck to the underwaters. So if there's a LED color or light that you are thinking about, we, I know we have it. Again, just go to glmarineinnovations.com, look us up, we'll be there. Contact us if, you know, if you're looking for something specific. Anything from the rope lighting, which is... You know, it changes any color you want, and it's also waterproof to uh, simple, simple light right here to an underwater light right here. Whoa, that thing is bright. <laughs> oh, yeah. So you've got the underwater lighting as well, available in LED. LED. Yeah. yeah, everything's flush mount. It's a very simple installation. There's no drilling big holes in your boat, yeah, which I know some people kind of get afraid of. All it is is it just screws right back on yeah. to your transom. You uh, you can either drill a hole in for the wire, which is three eighths of an inch, or you can have the wire running up the back of your transom to your power supply. And again, uh, something like this, you know, 20, 27 watts draws draws a little over an amp of energy. That's okay. LED. And it's supposed to last 50,000 hours, which is 13 years every single day. <laughs> Outstanding. Well, let's talk a little bit about the Kiwi inflatables down here as well. Tell me about these boats. It looks like there's a rigid hull boat. There's even one with a center console on it. What do you got down here, Steve? Uh, the good thing about these is, uh, you know, bottom line, you just don't see them anymore. Made in America. That's right. Annapolis, Maryland is where they're assembled. PVC with a uh, hard fiberglass bottom. You can get the custom helm seat, which folds down. Everything's electric on this. Uh, power start, power tilt. Uh, you can get it with a battery, obviously, so you can have running lights. This, this weighs around 135 pounds. Uh, the reason that Kiwi is so innovative is in Maryland, they're big sailors, and as sailors, the number one concern on the boat is weight. So the Kiwi was developed to be the lightest hard bottom PVC on the market, and that's what we tried to bring to the Great Lakes. Outstanding. Well, I certainly appreciate your time telling us about all these different products and services. If there's any one thing that you could say to the Great Lakes boaters out there, what would it be? I wish our season was longer. <laughs> Outstanding. Thanks so much for your time. And if we wanted to contact you guys, say that website one more time. It's www.glmarineinnovations.com. Thanks, Steve. Enjoy the rest of the show. Yeah, thank you, Eric.